A miraculous and heartbreaking story coming out of China where a newborn baby was rescued from a sewage pipe. Residents of an apartment building reportedly heard the weak cry of a baby boy and saw a tiny foot in the toilet of a communal restroom late Monday and called for help. When they arrived, authorities found the two-day-old infant seemingly flushed down the toilet in the pipe that was reportedly only about three inches in diameter. Unable to pull the baby out, rescuers went to the floor below and sawed away the entire section of sewer pipe. But still, the baby remained wedged inside. The section of the pipe was carried carefully to a nearby hospital. It seems he was flushed down the toilet very soon after he was born. His parents haven't been found. The abandoned infant is currently going by the name of the incubator he is recovering in, baby number 59. Now the question is, why would someone do this to a newborn baby, especially a boy? Because as NBC points out, with China's strict one-child policy, an attempt to relieve overcrowding, many families want a boy to carry on their name. Girls are often unwanted. Other potential explanations? Some couples, for example, uh, fear that they may face heavy government fines. Sometimes there's other cases of women simply get pregnant, they didn't realize they get pregnant or they didn't want to be pregnant. Baby number 59 is expected to make a full recovery, unbelievably only suffering severe bruising. Chinese authorities are investigating the case as attempted murder as they continue to search for the parents. For Newsy, I'm Jasmine Bailey.